beautiful people i'm gonna show you makeup tools which can help you during your everyday routine so let me start the brush holder from real techniques comes in different sizes uh, that's the one which i have and i use it to dry my brushes but also you can use them for storage or let's say when you're about to uh, get ready the minus because it has pre-made holders you need to get you need to fit specific brush also you cannot put more here we go. you need to find the right brush because otherwise it's, they're gonna be keep falling also you cannot put more than one brush in the space because they're gonna keep, be keep falling as well but it's a good space saver another thing which i have for the brushes is this sonia kashuk uh, brush holder which comes with many different holes they're silicone so pretty much you just put your brushes through because there are different size of the uh, holes you can put you can adjust to your brushes the thing which i like that is that you can sorry the thing which I like about it, that you can put few brushes in a bigger hole. So if you have many brushes, you just stick them in. So that's something worth looking into it. And also all the items which I'm showing you are the one which I have. I know there are different brands who make similar ones. This is only a suggestion. Next is a brush holder. And as you can see, you can fit multiple brushes. It ca comes with two, co two compartment, compartment. It comes with two different sizes. One cube is smaller than one cube is bigger than the other, so we can fit uh, many brushes. But also, you don't need to put brushes. You can also use your makeup. It's a nice way to store. But uh, talking about brushes this is another helpful tool which you're going to be using a lot obviously you can use fingers you just when you're on the go or if you're in the rush brushes are perfect tools and as as you can see i use different brands so it's real techniques sonia kashuk some brushes from marshall elf ego tools you already seen this piece that's uh, another makeup holder apparently it's a brush holder but i use it to store my makeup so this is like my everyday makeup or the one which i keep it in my bathroom but yeah it comes it has few co compartments as well so you can easily uh, split your makeup depending on what you're using another simple tool another simple tool is pencil sharpener but that's kind of obvious. Obviously, there are many things which you can use to dry your brushes. At the beginning, I was using the little, I don't know how you call them, the pedicure holders. And then, yeah, just plug them in and let them dry. People store their makeup in different places. As I showed before, I have the little round thing, but also uh, you can keep it like in a dry holder. If you have a lot of makeup or if you like to see it all are the uh, makeup sponges obviously makeup blender is the most popular one however many companies come up with their own versions now i have a whole jar of makeup sponges so i can easily choose from but not every not every single one is good so i will say try them out find the one which you like and then just stick to it for example that's the one from soho it's really good it's nice and squishy soft i don't know if they make them anymore but yeah i'm gonna uh, try to kill it now l'oreal has their own version version of the sponge and many people comparing this to the actual beauty blender as well as the sonia kashuk so def so i rotate between those two now the new thing for me are the air therapeutics and let me a little backtrack you can use the sponge while it's dry so it's going to give you more coverage 
or you wet it, that's when it grows big and you're getting more natural application. But yeah, that's my newest addition and so far I like it. Another thing are those, oh no, it's a toothpaste squeezer. I use them on, I use them to finish up my cosmetics or let's say uh, push them up. So let me demonstrate. So he, here we go, just put it at the end and just keep pushing the product down and then you know you got everything out of the tube. This is another uh, useful tool. You can you use it to clean your brushes. As you can see, it has different grids depending on the brush. So you can easily pour the little, I don't know, shampoo or the liquid in it and just, just take the brush and then just swoosh it. So it makes your uh, cleaning process way faster. Now talking about cleaning. Uh, another good thing is the makeup, let's say the brush shampoo. That's the one which I have currently, but you can use any baby shampoo. They're really gentle and they do the same work. Now for the beauty blenders, that's this. For the beauty blenders uh, and also brushes, the solid cleanser is good. Uh, many companies make them however with the cleansing stuff you can use simple items like soap which you have at home or baby shampoo there is there are also another options hope you enjoyed the video and i see you guys in the next video